Hey guys, so we're going to be looking at internet access. How do we get it and what do we need in order to get it? So let's have a look. So you need to get online, but you're not sure how to do that. As she just said, you're not sure how to get online. I should probably take that out. Well, yes, I just thought that. I thought this would be funny at the time. <laughs> it's just not funny anymore. It's like my 20th take. I can help you, says the lady. You can. It's easier than you think. And actually it is. All right. It is? Well, I just said it is, yes. Okay, so here is what you need, guys. First of all, you need one of these devices, which is a router. This is a router. A router routes traffic. Okay, so you'll see in a minute why we need that. And in the next lesson, the next video, you'll also see how we use a router. Okay, then you need to have an account with an ISP. An ISP is a company that will sell access to the internet every month at a certain price, depending on what sort of access it is that you want. So ISP stands for Internet Service Provider. You also are going to need some sort of a connection medium. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, I mean an actual line, like a fiber line or an ADSL line, asynchronous digital subscriber line, okay, or asymmetrical digital subscriber line. And you will see it works with a, a special filter that we have. One line for your ADSL, the other line for your phone, because they are two different kinds of signals on the same line. Or you could have LTE. So there's three different ways, three different methods of getting online in terms of the platform that we can use. So you can see that we have a wired connection already and we have a wireless connection. Just as a note here, you can see like this is a LTE modem, okay, or an LTE dongle. You, it'll often have a SIM card that we put inside and then that accesses an LTE connection with your internet service provider or your um, mobile services provider and you'll have internet access through LTE. Some of them have wireless modems such as this one here, okay, which means that the SIM card actually goes into the router itself, into the, mo the mo modem slash router and you've then got access through that at home but that's still an LTE connection. In our next video we'll have a look at this in more depth. Blah, 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 blah. Ugh.